hello lovely people welcome back to my channel in today's video i share how to make ghanaian dry pop pop properly known as gobe yeah this is my favorite pop pop this is your first time watching my video please make sure you hit the subscribe button below let's get started adding half tablespoon is in a warm water one tablespoon sugar then stir all together cover it and put it aside now i'll go ahead and measure my flour i'm using four parts of flour or you measure 500 grams of flour yeah, you can use bread flour or all-purpose flour. I'm using all-purpose flour for this recipe. I'll add a salt to paste, nut milk, then sieve all together. Now, I'll go ahead and add quarter cup of sugar. You can add more. Then you stir all together until it's well combined. Now I'll go ahead and take a bowl and bake one egg into a bowl. Then add evaporated milk. Beat all together. After that, then you put it aside. I'll go ahead and add one tablespoon of margarine into my flour. You can also use two tablespoons, but I want only one tablespoon. Then you mix all together. Now I'll make a little hole in a flour. Then I'll go ahead and add my activated yeast. And also add my milk and egg. I'm going to add it gradually until it forms a dough. I'm not going to add all at a time. I'm going to add it gradually at a time. So you go ahead and add it until it forms a dough. Yeah, I'll add a little water. I'm going to add my water until I get to the exact texture I want. This is the exact texture that I want. I'll need it to mold and then cover it for just 5 minutes to rest. I will dust my working surface. Then place my dough and start kneading. Here you are going to take your time and knead it very well. Because kneading takes a little time. Make sure you knead your dough very well. It will take you 15 minutes to 20 minutes to knead the dough. So you keep on kneading. I will place the dough in a bowl, then cover it to rest for an hour. After an hour, I'm going to divide it into two parts. Then 
then cut it into a smaller sizes then work at a time I'll go ahead and dust my tray then put it aside Yeah, I'll go ahead and mold my dough into a round shape. This is how I do it. Now I'm going to cover it and allow it to rest for 2 hours. After 2 hours, you can see the dough has increased in size. I have already put my oil on fire. To test the oil temperature, you can drop a little dough. If the oil is hot, the dough is going to float on top. Then you remove it. I'll go ahead and add my puff puff into the oil. Yeah, please, you have to fry it on a medium heat. Then you keep on turning at a time until the color changes to golden brown. Now, for puff is ready, I'm taking it out. This is the color that I prefer. Thank you so, so much for watching my video. Please don't forget to subscribe to my channel. You can leave your comments on the comment section. Remember to turn 